shoots a host once again. And the number 15 seed has a chance to vault to the Super Regionals in this real miss in a matchup of the winners from Friday. So with that win, Utah advances. Ole Sometimes you'll see maybe a team goes to the number two, number three, just in case. But you look at by Sykes, who moves up to the two hole today and Smith. That's one, two and three due up next weekend. Utah is certainly in the driver's seat. It's one both of in this one and it advances. Lassiter swings and lifts this one out to deep right center. Chases Abby Dayton back. One away. I mean, they have been here every day. We had more than 2,400 fans yesterday. Now it's Sykes who bounces that one over to Ballardi. Might have dropped it. Throw to first. That pulls Bonstrom off the base. Rebels now have to climb the mountain. Maybe a Wasatch-sized mountain in Salt Lake City because it must. that was it. So Smith works the two out walk. City. A couple of doubles, a triple. She missed her second homer of Leverett for Jamie Traxel lately. That one looked like it hit the wrist. Brady takes her base. From yesterday, three hits in the three games for Ole Miss. Third strike, getting over. The first of maybe many. It's a melee on Friday against Southern Illinois. Ballardi puts it into play. This is Kayla Komoku, who retires the speedster. One gone. So that's a good start for. Bonstrom's hit 347 this year, so 52 RBIs. This for Bonstrom. Swings and misses, and Riley has retired the first two. The sophomore from Dandridge, Tennessee weekend in the SEC tournament when Ole Miss took out. She has posted a 1-4-3 ERA in Salt Lake City and she's just delivered a 1-2-3 inning. Scoreless. Room and got strong from last year to this year. And Kayla Alley by the way leads off the second with a base hit. And so last the spin and the forearm and working those fingers. And the velocity up towards 70 miles an hour. Whitley tries to move the runner over. She's got great speed and does so. So Allie in scoring position. Whitley move one. Furbush takes a strike. A skilled two-way player. She's been in the circle. Pause, standing outside the box. One, two. Pops it up. This one's out to right. Ortiz has a beat on it. Runner does not tag. Right. That's where that ball ends up. 35 at-bats this year for Jones. Punches that one. It's on the chalk. Jimenez all over it. Getting is over. So Lopez allows the leadoff single. But Jimenez, Dayton. Uh -huh. overall seed UCLA. If Utah can come away with this game right here, it would be a little history. It would be hosting Super Regional. So you can just feel it. You can feel it. Uh, the energy has been palpable. I mean, there's been a love affair with Davison clobbers it out to left. Gone. The 11th of the year for Carly Davison. That gives her the team lead as a freshman. And her damage, we talked about this yesterday, we talked about it the day before. Her Three. I mean, that was a tone-setting blast, similar to the one she hit on Friday. That one's lined up the middle of base hit. And the first three have reached against Dayton in the second inning. Three very hard-hit balls. You hit 350 in this batting order, it's like, you know, the sixth. Senior from Phoenix, bunts it, Sykes jumps on it. It moves the runner over, one away. Well done by this is Kendall Lundberg, the catcher, bounces that one up the middle. Lasting her up with it. She's got a great arm, but no chance to get Dayton. Three-nothing. You're Riley. Two-thirds innings this tournament. That one's fouled behind the plate, so Bennett has to head back to first base. Looks like oh, it's the Saturday plays out that you can't control. 
Bolardi drops that one into right. Ortiz, a stop halfway between second and third. Jones's throw is on T, right? Absolutely. Is that what, what you would lean on? Absolutely. Bonstrom. So there's friends across the country on different teams. Bonstrom hits it hard right to Smith. She's got to hurry. Here comes Ortiz. The tag is in time. Great. He's able to limit the damage to three runs. Blue ball and the backdoor curve. That one's lined down the line. Ortiz plays it on a hop. So the leadoff hitter is aboard for a second straight inning. Your senior. Out of eligibility. She wants. He's from Lassiter and Sykes. Sykes bounces it to second. Bellardi to second for one. The turn in time. Four, six, three. Sharp to start. They've won their two games. Ole Miss in the double elimination tournament. If it falls, it's out. And the Utes advance to. And she might be extra thankful for her bat. Got to have it in the lineup. Hits the ball hard right at Kamoku. Nice stab. So there's one away. But just everything that just it's maybe a bunch of players with that quote unquote the proverbial chip on the shoulder. Oregon State ended up winning that series 2-1. Jimenez rips that one through the left side. So Julia Jimenez, the two-time all-conference selection. And snubbly rules and all of that. So the commitment started in the summer. Finished in an hour. Right. Got it done. Oh. Oh, Jimenez stumbled off the base. Was still able to get back in time. The throw from Brady pulled. What kind of caliber team we are. We just need to execute a little bit better, prepare ourselves a little bit more different. And believe that we can. And it started in the summer and went into the. He's the head coach of that area. I let him go. And of course, he's going to be Paige Parker. Dayton pops this one up. And it falls into center. And Menez gets the stop sign. So the bases are loaded. This is Denning. Bounces it left side. Alley coming home. Going to get the lead runner. So there's two gone. You know, just to backpedal to that first inning. Lid on this thing. Maybe but got to win twice today. 1-1 one, one has popped up. Maybe playable for Smith and foul ground. And Riley dances out of a bases loaded jam. Pitched the complete game shutout yesterday against this Ole Miss team. Gave up just. Brady bounces it right back to the circle. One away. 30-40 win team in the SEC the last to do some damage against Lopez. Komoku bounces that hard to Jimenez. On to first in time, two away. Bellardi in second, so you just saw the play from Jimenez. They turn to 4-6. Alley swings, drills it into left. That's a base hit, and it splits the gap. So Alley on the move, around second, stops there. And a, a lot of left-handed hitters in this regional. Lopez the lefty. Trying to stifle Ole Miss again. Let's it go. Off speed is there. A called third strike, and the inning is over. To Utah. So that means you have to play later. Base hit for Shelby Ortiz to start the fourth inning. She's on her way to second, trying to stretch it. Slides in safe. Then she knocked in a pair of runs against Ole Miss yesterday. Pilardi, a high chop. That's going to get through. Ortiz gets the wave. She scores. It's 4 0. She's fired up. Pilardi, just a simple chop. And because of the runner at second base, Michaela Alley is playing a little bit out of position. And speed for. Uh, it's a rotation that Traxel has. She really does. She has five. Bonstrom waves and misses. And Sparks sits her down. That's the second time Bonstrom has struck out today. Hawkes bounces it to the left side. Runner has to hold. Sykes retires. Hawkes, who again is nursing a little bit of that knee injury. But here's Jimenez. There's two for two today. Swing. This one is drilled out to deep center. Lasseter, though, underneath it, and that's the inning. So Sparks out of the Bull City Natives, Utah alums. Lopez plunks Furbush.
to start the top half of the fifth inning. Is a team best, one of the better totals in the S. Lopez strikes her out. That's three for the junior. One away. Away there from Stevenson. Lassiter with her second base hit of the afternoon, and it might be extra bases. Furbush, or make it the pinch runner, rounds third, scores, throw to third. Lassiter is out. out. Dayton, Davison, Jimenez, that is exactly how you do it. You practice cut. Braid to show the emotions. That's up high. So that's ball four. About Oregon trying to play spoiler and Fayetteville at 3 1. Smith takes that low, so that's back to back free passes. A 316 average. Bounces it to third. Jimenez has got it. And the threat is over. The Rebels do score. After a stunner on Friday. Brewing yourself. Davison pops that one up into left. Playable for Whitley, so Sparks has gone four up, four down. And one of the four teams that we saw, maybe, maybe they catch that break. Dayton just walked. Brings Denning had three hits, Alabama and Florida. High chop to Alley, only played a first. Not in time. Presence on the Pac-12 first team. Anytime you look at the stats in the stolen base category. Swings, hits this one down the line. Whitley is there, makes the catch. Two away. I don't think Lundberg is in advances to the Supers next weekend. Ole Miss, one-two pitch. Bounce right back to the circle. Sparks with a scoreless fit. And so the Rebels go back to work. Who the slugger from Hawaii takes a call third strike. One away. These hitters are saying, okay, the right-handed hitters, she's pitching us outside, but which way is it? Bounce to first. Bonstrom's there, two away. Whitley pops it up, in comes the center fielder, Dayton, that falls for a base hit. I envy those third base coaches. If, I had to, if you asked me to coach third base, I'd be like, you mean... From Lopez, way to miss, and it is over. Three outs away. Okay, it has stood the test of time. I salute its longevity. Lived and now you're a fan for life. Bellardi, can she beat it out? Nice play by Smith at first. You know, Allie Morris as well. I mean, those are two play World Series. <laughs> Line drive right to Sykes, there's two gone. I, I mean, at least it's six Eastern time. That one is fair down the line. Hawkes running with the Busted knee, just pulls up around first. The senior from Fontana. Yeah. That one is lined into center. Lassiter's got it. Utah is three outs away from hosting us. The senior from... To the right side. Bellardi's got it. One out. Freshman Jayla Lassiter, who is a strong defensive center field. Line right back to Lopez. <laughs> Sykes bounces it up the middle, a base hit. Savannah Sykes, the fifth year senior, the transfer from Georgia. The senior today is walked twice. That's tapped over to the right side. Bellardi to first. Utah does it. 
Three wins in three days. Regional next weekend, right here in Salt Lake City. Oh, and Paige Parker, team effort here, defense, offense, pitching, just a lights out performance. In back to back complete game performances where she overwhelms Ole Miss. And Kenzie Fowler, our producer, Steve Elkin. Director Jason Moon, I'm Kevin Fitzgerald saying so long.